guys, welcome back to Love the Bunny, and today I am here with my friend, and she has a few questions about owning rabbits, and I'm going to be answering those questions, and we're going to be settling some of those thoughts. So let's just get started. I have a bunny rabbit, but I think I would really like to get one because he looks so soft and fluffy. I kind of just want to pet him and squeeze him. Oh, no. Don't pet him or squeeze him. He usually doesn't like that. He just likes to, like... If you want to interact with your rabbit, you need to lay on the ground and let him come to you because that really scares him. Oh, I don't know. Well, if I was thinking about getting a rabbit, wouldn't it be kind of messy because they poop everywhere? It's actually not messy at all. Well, how do you keep the poop controlled? You can litter train your rabbit and you can change your litter box every week. So they go in a litter box? Yes, they oh. usually don't ever poop on the floor. Well, that's interesting. Do you have to train them to do that? Yes. So how do you do that? You like put, so when they pee or poop on the floor, you put it in the litter box and eventually they learn to go in there because their scent is in there. How long does it take to train them? Usually about two weeks, I think. Oh. Dumper was already kind of half litter trained and Theo's already litter trained when I got him. Well, the other thing I was kind of worried about was grooming. Is it hard to groom them when no, you take care of them? No, not at all. I only have three grooming tools I use for my rabbits. Mm -hmm. And it's really not. So I have like this dog mitt thing and I have a brush I bought online and then I have um, another little rubber mitt thing that I use. That actually sounds relaxing. Do they it like is, it? It is. He usually likes it. Theo doesn't like it. Thumper loves Thumper it. Thumper loves it. Well, also, my biggest fear about having a bunny rabbit is the expense. Is it very expensive to It around? actually is. I'm going to tell you the truth. So this veggies, they go through about, this is cilantro, so you don't get this in heads. You get it in bunches. They go through three to four of those, three to four heads of lettuce, which is big heads of romaine, green leaf, red leaf, and kale a week. Oh, wow. And then you have to pay for their hay and their pellets. Their pellets are usually about probably $15 a month. Depends on how much you feed your rabbit, which you, rabbits don't need a lot of pellets. And then hay you're supposed to feed unlimited, which you give a lot of hay. So like Timothy hay is pretty expensive. Like the Oxford Timothy hay is about $23. Okay. And if you have to go to the vet, that can be up to $200. Oh, wow. And also, I know that they're not like cats and dogs. They don't have, you know, they don't really jump around and play like a cat or a dog would. So what, what are the kind of toys that you want to have? Well, they love chew toys like this one. Is it so, is it hard? It's oh, hard. It's, hard it's, is it rock. made out of wood? Yes. This and this, these are some chew toys I just have on my rug here. See, they will make these little bite marks and they chew on them to wear their front teeth down. And for their back teeth, they use hay because they have molars all the way in the back. And then you can also use like plastic baby toys. They love to throw these around. They're kind of everywhere. And you can use baby chains. You can use cat toys like jingly balls and pet store toys. So are rabbits fun to play with? Yes, they actually are. Like you can restack the cups and throw around their baby chains and give them treats and do agility and tricks. And stuff. Now you said that this kind of helps wear their teeth down. Mm -hmm. So when you take them to the vet, do they have to have anything done to their teeth? Not unless, usually rabbits that have to have something done with their teeth never get hay or get to play with chew toys very much or they are interested in the toys you give them. Okay. Well, that kind of answers a lot of my questions, so maybe I'll think about getting a bunny rabbit soon now that I know a little bit more about it. Thank you for watching. Love the bunny. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more rabbit care and informational videos. Please have a comment down below about your things, questions you have about rabbits if you're a rabbit owner or if you don't own rabbits at all. So, see you in my next video. Bye!